Hey guys, on today's video, we're going to be installing some RAM in your Mac. So, we're actually not going to put it down. I'm not actually doing it standing up because I don't see it necessary. I don't think you guys have to put it down in order to get the RAM out. It's kind of easy. All you guys have to do is unplug this right here. Okay, and there's a button right above. Anyways, once you guys unplug it, just leave it unplugged for five minutes to 10 minutes if you recently use your Mac. Make sure to touch some wood with your hands because you don't want any static on your hands once you guys get your hands on the old RAM and especially the new RAM. Because the old RAM, who cares if it burns out, but the new RAM, that's very important. So just make sure you have no static on your hands, just touch some wood, like I said, and let your Mac cool down. So here is the button, it's right above. Okay, once you press it, a door up here is going to open up. So let me just show you the door. That's this door right here. That's going to open up. That's where the RAM is at. So again, we're just going to press this. From there, you guys should see this pop out. Okay, so what I used was a credit card. I just pressed on it really hard. Obviously, a credit card that I didn't care about. So this comes out like so. Just make sure you know how it's coming out. So this is the... Same way that's gonna go back in this way. Okay, that's how this top looks like. And that's your RAM in there. Okay, so I do have four slots right now because I already upgraded two slots and I'm, uh, I'm going to upgrade the other two. I'm gonna clean this dust from here as well. And that's the next part from this. This is the RAM that we're gonna be installing this iMac. So that's the numbers that you would look for. It's from Crucial. What I always do with Crucial is just scan my computer. And that way I can get the exact thing that's compatible with it, okay? So this is what's compatible with my iMac, okay? It might be different for yours. So just make sure to scan and use that program. I do have a video showing you guys how to use their website. And so far I've used it for actually a few years. And every time I upgrade anything from a Mac, I always use them. Just because it makes it so easy. Um, by scanning your computer. All I just don't like about these guys is that they use Amazon and other websites and they don't have it in stock anymore. But anyways, besides that, <laughs> this is the RAM that you guys need. Let's just get on with this. So, RAM. so this brand new RAM. Again, touch some wood before you guys touch the actual RAM. The brand new RAM and then the old RAM, same deal touch some wood, don't have any static on your hands. And make sure your computer has been off for at least 10 minutes before you proceed with anything. Even before taking that part off, you guys should have waited. Okay guys, so what we're gonna do is press on these little dudes outwards and this will pop out. So, I'm gonna have to use my both hands. I'm gonna get kind of in the way. So, Okay, so you guys, as long as you guys pull them outwards, they will come out and here are the slots. So all we have to do is pull them out and that way, um, that's all we have to do. Just pull them out and put the new ones in. So like I said, I already upgraded. So there's some of these are new. I'm going to see which ones are new and which ones are old. I think the top ones are the new ones and these guys must be the originals. So I'm going to pull on it to hear like a clicking sound. And there we go. So that's my old RAM. Okay, and it goes in this way. You guys can see how it came out. So this this thing goes in that way. Okay, so we're gonna just settle it down. Take the next one out. There we go. And it's out. So this is the original old one again. Let me just show you guys a close up since you guys may want to see the original and how that looks like. Okay, now we're going to put in the new one. So this is the crucial one. And sorry about that. Keep in mind that this, keep in mind the way that it's going in, that's how it's going to go in, okay? It's not going to fit any other way anyways, so I wouldn't worry about it too much. Just slide it in, press on it. You guys should hear like, it's not a large click pin sound, but you do hear it once it's really in there. Okay. 
There we go. So as long as you guys hear like a clipping sound, you're good to go. So just make sure that's good. I'm gonna make sure my other ones are still good. Nothing became loose. And we're good to go. And all we have to do, it's the same deal, right? We pressed it out. So now we have to press it kind of out again. Get back in there. It's all good. And we're done. That's all you guys have to do. Our very last step is just putting this guy on. So again, this is going in this way. Okay. And there we go. So that's how you change your RAM. That's how you guys can switch up your RAM for your Mac. It's pretty easy. All you guys have to do is turn on your Mac. Everything should work right away. There's no setup for RAM, okay? It should detect it. It should be all good. If you guys have problems with it, then there might be something wrong with the RAM itself. But usually, the RAM is really, really easy to change it up like you just saw. Anyways, that's it for this video tutorial. If you guys have any questions, comments, you can write them down here below in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.